when my back hit, it hurt so bad, lights went out. That's when I went black. I just passed out. It's been just 20 days since Jeremy Gerard had his life flash before his eyes. What started as a family skiing trip quickly turned to tragedy when Jeremy Gerard, a 13-year combat veteran from Springfield, was critically injured in a skiing accident in Santa Fe, New Mexico. I remember skiing down the mountain behind the ski patrol and just kind of laid up that orange parachute around me and I'm just looking at the sky like, Lord, I don't, I don't, <laughs> just completely lost with what's going on right now. I'm just scared. On February 7th, Jeremy was skiing with family when he lost control, crashed into trees, lacerating his liver, breaking his ribs, puncturing a lung, dislocating his hips and breaking his back. I went black and I didn't wake up for over a week later. Day after day, doctors questioned Jeremy's fate. Would he live? Would he be brain dead? But miraculously, he woke up. He opened his eyes and he looked over at me. You know, I was, I was surprised and, you know, I told him I loved him and he nodded and it was, <laughs> it was like this huge weight was just lifted because this whole time we thought he was gone. Surgery after surgery, doctors wondered if he would ever walk again. But he didn't give up and decided to keep fighting. With his family and friends by his side, Jeremy grew stronger each and every day. Now the question is not if he will ever walk again, it's just how soon. I've always been one who loves a challenge. 